on this couch. My big comfy couch here at Cena's Dolls. Hello everyone. Hello and welcome back to the big comfy couch. Yes. I hope you all are feeling well. I hope you guys are feeling good. I hope you guys are just in really good spirits this beautiful Saturday morning. Who you all see in front of you is Miss Flossie. And we also have one of my newest babies. My one of my it's actually one of my birthday babies. Yes, this was a beautiful birthday gift from my dolly sis Maritza at Dolly Lane 19. Yeah, so you guys see me when I opened her on my live, but you guys have not seen her since. So I'm going to show her along with my other Behringer dog collection. Yes. But before we get started, go ahead and hit the like button. Go ahead and subscribe if you're not already subscribed. And share this video with your other dolly friends. All right. So, like I said, you guys are going to see my Behringer doll, Behringer doll collection this morning. So, I am participating in a couple of tags so it's today is saturday i'm going to participate in play day saturday yes and that's from that's hosted by patricia at patricia's dolly dreams so um since this behringer collection that i have it, it is i would consider it consider them my toy part of my collection they are collectibles but they are also they could also be toys so this is um my dolly toy type dolls in my collection are my behringer doll collection and since today is saturday why not go ahead and play play with my toys on saturday morning like i used to do back in the day it just brings me back to my childhood i get to play this saturday all right, and I'm also participating in Dress Up Thursday because, I mean, I know it's Saturday, <laughs> but I wanted to participate in Dress Up Thursday, okay? Don't do that. Don't do that. We participated in a, a play day Thursday wow. on a Saturday. Hush, Miss Flossie. Okay, so the theme for play day Saturday is all dog. I meant to say the theme for Dress Up Thursday. Dress Up Thursday got mixed up. Matter, yes, and my Barrington doll collection matter too in this doll collecting hobby. So I'm going to show them some love. I have not showed them in such a long time. So Play Day Thursday, or Dress Up Thursday, I'm sorry. Dress Up Thursday, that's what it's called. Dress Up Thursday, I hope I said that. Dress Up Thursday is hosted by Stephanie at In Love with Reborns 2011. Yes. So, I want to get started. I have a lot to show. Um, I'm going to have to speed up the video some, you know, because um, I don't have that much time. I actually have a study session in about an hour. As, as you guys know, I'm in school. So, we have like a a Saturday study session that I need to join so I'm make I gotta make sure I do that so yes so we're starting with this one here oh and then the channels that I mentioned the channel names will be linked in the description of this video okay so um I'll make I want to make sure that I do participate in dress up Thursday and the all dolls matter because we have a lot of people that are um in the doll hobby that have different types of dolls that do have these the store bought type of dolls um and i want to let you guys know that you guys are welcome here you you and your babies um are welcome here on the big comfy couch at cena's dolls because your dolls matter too it doesn't matter if your doll is a Amazon doll or you got it from Target or Walmart or is it it's a knockoff doll or whatever. You love your baby, I love your baby, okay? So let me get this pillow. Marissa also um 
bought this cover on the couch for me um for my birthday and i love it i've been getting so many compliments on this um this cover this beautiful blanket the background is just awesome just awesome all right so this little one does not have a name yet she was she's a behringer baby look how pretty her face is um i'm gonna i'm gonna change her i thought i was gonna change her into a boy but i want her to be a girl she looks like a girl i want to put her on this sleeper it's like a salmon pink background and it has apples yeah i thought this was a pear i don't know what this is maybe it's apple and pear maybe two apples i don't know and then uh i'm gonna put her on a t-shirt a onesie this is green with hearts on it so cute um i just want to um show her show her body marissa got her off of amazon and um she is really 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 cute i don't know what i want to name her but this is a cute um doll for anybody who's interested in getting one of these isn't she adorable she has like the open mouth and this little bath pacifier came with her but it's it's made onto her um her outfit so you won't lose it but you can st still like um put a little pacifier in her mouth i actually have a box of pacifiers that i bought um off of paradise gallery i should show that because i know one of those pacifiers i will I sh um will be able to fit in her mouth because it came with so many different sizes I'm gonna put her on this diaper since she does not have on a diaper. I'm gonna put her on this little tight tight. Um, here. I'm gonna show my box of pacifiers. I don't know if I have time today. I, I don't like doing a video when I'm feeling a little rushed and I have a lot to show, but I think it's gonna work out. I think it's going to work out. I think I have plenty of time. Sometimes I just panic for no apparent reason. But she is so cute. Oh, so this is going to be part of my changing marathon. I'm going to make this part four since I'm going to be changing multiple babies. Okay, this is y'all's marathon. It's the spring slash summer um, changing marathon that I started. This is going to be my part four. Okay, and and also this is going to be part of my um, no dolls left behind <laughs> doll changing. I mean doll count. Okay, because I I didn't show my doll count with my um, Behringer babies, so this is also going to be part of my no dolls left behind dolly doll count. Okay, okay, Josie, do you hear me? Do you hear me? <laughs> And Josie will be here next week. I can't wait to meet her. I'm so excited. I just don't know what to do, you guys. I cannot believe our meetup is um next week. Like around this time, next week we will be together. That is crazy. Uh. That is crazy. So yes. <clears throat> so excited. So excited. I have not shown my, my Behringer doll collection in a long time. I think over a year. I have not touched them. They've just been put up. Um, But I still love my collection. I'm the type of collector where I don't have to interact with all my dolls um, often. But I still want them in my collection. So, it just is what it is, y'all. It is what it is. All right, so look how cute she is. And look at her, my red tie. Look at her. Look how cute she is. Oh my goodness. And look at her. See, these are really cute dolls. And there's nothing wrong with having manufactured play dolls in your collection. Like, and don't let don't let nobody tell you um who you can collect, what you can't collect, and all of that. No. Uh-uh. 
Do a you a boo. A do you. Okay. I'm gonna put this in her hair. Cause this is a girl. She could be a boy, it doesn't matter. But I only have one boy in my Behringer collection. He gonna be the only boy. Look how cute. I wonder if her finger can go in her mouth. Oh my goodness, she's so pretty, y'all. Oh, look at how sweet. Oh my goodness. Now tell me this not a sweet baby girl. Some people weigh these dolls, like put more weight. But Barringer is the original OGs of Rebording. Let's get that straight. It's the Barringer dolls are the dolls that are the original OGs of um, Rebording. Before all the sculpting and all of that, they would take Barringer dolls and repaint them, reweigh them and everything um, to feel like a real baby. Okay, let's not, let's uh, not forget that, okay? Let's not do that. We got to show our Behringer dolls the utmost respect because they started the the, um, the whole reborn um, catastrophe or whatever I'm trying to say. But, okay, so I also... <laughs> oh my goodness, this bag is in the way. Okay, so I also have a box opening for y'all. Well, she's been here for a long time and I already opened her, but um, I kept her in the box because she was going to go back to the website I bought her something from. She's going to go back to the original owner because they straight tried it. And let me show you. Okay. Here she is. Let's check her out. Okay. So this is a Behringer doll that I saw on my car that I thought was the cutest ever. Because look. <laughs> look at her hair. She got afro puffs. <laughs> she got afro puffs. Look how cute. I thought she was so cute. Look at her. She's full body vinyl. Right? She was standing there in the ad looking so cute. Let me do something with her bangs. I don't have nothing up here. No brush or nothing. But look at her afro puffs. Oh my goodness. I loved her hair. I loved her eyes. Look at her big eyes and they're looking off to the side. Like she's about to tell somebody off, right? Um, so when I got her out, I mean she's very, very hard vinyl. Let me say that. She's very, very hard vinyl. When I got her out of the box, I noticed something was wrong with her. She has a defect. It is her a leg. Her leg was pushed in like this and stuck this way look at that big dent in her thigh who does this what in the world going on with this push it to the side and then it wasn't even shown in the pictures it wasn't disclosed of or anything look at that and this is how this is a normal size leg yeah right so this one is pushed in i don't even know how to fix it maybe i could warm it up or something i don't know i'm just i don't know nothing about warming up no vinyl <laughs> but it's pushed in if anybody know how to get this dent out let me know so i took pictures of it and sent it to makari you know so i could return her and they gave me my money back and said that i could keep her they said don't worry about sending her back you can keep her so she's in my collection and she with a dented leg and everything you know what i'm saying um which which is nice, you know, just looking her over. I I didn't really look her over. I wanted to make a video with her. Okay, okay. She got the little chunky rose and everything on her. Um, she's just pretty. I thought she was really pretty. And I thought that she would be a really cool addition to my manager collection. So that is she and this is her. It's just going to be what it's going to be. I'm not going to change her in this video um, or anything like that for the purposes of time. So that's her. And I'm about to show y'all some of the Behringer dolls that I had that you guys have seen before. I'm going to get them dressed. I actually have um, this bag of Behringer doll clothes, which is doll clothes, but I, I consider it to be my 
toy doll clothes in these bags that came out of the box. I'm just going to be looking in this bag for outfits because I don't have anything pre-planned at all. At all. Okay, so I'm going to start with this one. Look how cute. Now, some of the names I probably don't, I don't even remember. Um, I think this one was Tootie or something <laughs> because of her lip. Look at her lip. Look at her pouty lip. So I do like the collective Behringer dolls that look different to me, that look unique because I like to have a unique collection. So look how adorable she looks. She mad. <laughs> and she hasn't been out in a long time. It's not my fault. It's not my fault. Look how pretty she is. Oh my goodness. She is just so cute. I like not um, playing with my dolls for a long time and then take them out, bring them out. I mean, not take them out, <laughs> bring them out. And it's just like having a new doll. So she has a cute onesie. I might just leave her onesie on um, for the sake of time anyway, because it's hot and it's cute. It has like unicorns and hearts on it. I think she'll be fine. Look how cute she is. I have to look back at videos to see what I named my babies. I forgot. It's been it's been that long. But that's okay because everything is documented. Oh, you know what? This shirt go with this outfit because it's the same pattern. Let me say something. Let me say something. And this I'm just looking through this bag. Maybe I can put her on something. She like put me on something, Mama. Look how you did me. That's so long. I'm gonna put on this. It's a cute little yellow outfit. She has a little diaper. I'm gonna just find this little yellow dress here because her outfit is a set. I like to keep my sets together i do i do oh so she has already have on a newborn diaper we're gonna keep that on her i think then her name i think her name matched with another one ruby and tootie i think i'm not sure <laughs> I'm gonna just put this on her. Oh, look at her earrings. She got her little ears pierced. See, I love my babies now. I do love my babies. Um, it's just that it wasn't their time yet. It wasn't their time. And I love the full body vinyl because you don't have to worry about having a onesie on them to cover them up or anything like that. That's all no 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 oh look how precious that fit her so cute so how many we have so far we have three three behringers on the couch okay so next up is my cute little asian behringer baby yes 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 and look at her look at her look how pretty let's scoop this one over she's my only behringer baby you can tell <laughs> they was dressed for the winter season all bundled up yes they are so she's so cute my little asian beauty here oops so <laughs> i had her all bundled up look at it so you can tell these babies was loyal they're they're loved okay and my little collection isn't that right she looks so cute in her outfit i gotta find her something you know what i'm gonna put her in this blue outfit over here that i just took out and like I said, I don't I don't remember names. Now this this Behringer baby here, she actually um she has a cloth body. So she has the vinyl limbs and head, and she has a um 
a cloth body and i i got this baby from she was gifted to me actually from my dolly sis brawin <laughs> the dolly sis brawin she gifted her to me i need to brush her hair down and she put her on this wig it, she didn't um come with all this hair she put her on this cute a wig yes she did so i'm just gonna slick her on this cute little outfit here and this is a cute little outfit i got off of um amazon right a ways back this these are just toy doll clothes actually that you can order off of amazon or any website aliexpress or whatever she has on her cloth a diaper cute I'll put that on her. I want to order some more of these doll outfits. I like these doll outfits for my collection. And then she has these little footies that came with the, the outfit here. So I'm going to put on her. Now, I don't think all my dolls is going to fit on this couch. Um, all my Behringer dolls. But we'll see. We'll see. And then this cute little hat here. Cute. Oh my goodness, look how cute. Oh my goodness. That's so adorable on this play day Saturday. They just playing with their dolls. They just sparkle up. Oh yeah, they think they sparkles. <laughs> Goes up here like that. I think I should get her some little earrings. Look how cute. Is this not cute or not? Is this not cute? Is it not cute? I think I'm going to give them all some, take their, them some pictures. Then I'll get her a hair bow. I'm going to take their pictures and post them in the community tab. But look how pretty she looks. Oh my goodness. She's pretty. All right. Another one down. Then we have one that don't have a diaper on. I got to put a diaper on. <laughs> She's nagging. I'll probably just put her on the onesie. We have this one. Look at her face. Is she sweet? Yes, she is. She's one of my um very first ones that I bought when I started getting into Behringer. She feels really, really soft. She came with um the birth certificate and everything. I'm just putting her down low like this. I know you can't see her, but she has the parts. <laughs> she has the parts for real. I know they have some Behringer dolls like at um, Walmart. They don't make with the uh, anatomically correct um, those dolls but this one these here she got all her parts okay she's yeah I'm a girl I'm a girl she's so pretty okay I'm just gonna put her on this it says hello pretty princess that's what she's gonna wear just this little onesie and they're right and she feels so soft like the way she feels is different from like this one um, and I found her second hand. This one right here, I bought her off of um, Amazon a few years back. And that's when I was um, posting in the Behringer um, doll group on Facebook. Yes, I was because I love to be in the group. I used to love to be in the group. In the group I said, before I had my YouTube channel, that's what I used to do uh, was take this dress my dolls and take pictures of them and post my dolls in a group and interact in a group with a lot of my uh, dolly friends and then when I got my YouTube channel that like ceased everybody probably was like what happened to her but look how cute look how cute how sweet is her oh my god she's so sweet she's just sitting on flossy let me make this up some. Look at this. Look at this crew, y'all. And that's not the end of it. So let's count. One, two, three, four, five so far. And we still have some babies over here. Yes, we do. All right. I'm going to get one. Okay, her hat just fell off. 
All right, so this is technically not a Behringer doll. This one here, she is a Antonio Sanchez, I think. Let me see, I pronounced that. Uh-uh, Antonio Juan. Antonio Juan. Who am I was Antonio Sanchez? Who is Antonio Sanchez? Is that an uh, actor? <laughs> that actor so I was like why did Tony Sanchez this is Antonio Juan okay or right, yeah Antonio Juan um doll which she is just so precious I got her from Broadway too um and Broadway put a put a wig on her because she her hair is like this um so, yeah, she's all bundled up. I got to get her out of this. Let's get her out of this. Yes, look at her big feet. She has really big feet. And she is really soft vinyl. Like, her her vinyl, this vinyl's not soft, but it feels, like, silky. This, her vinyl is soft vinyl. She's a soft vinyl baby. So, I just, since she's the only doll that I have of Antonio Juan, um, from Spain. She's from Spain. That's what she is. She's from Spain. I just um, decided to um, throw her into my Van Ranger doll collection because she, her body is just like the Van Ranger dolls, okay? But it's from a different company, a different sculptor, and it's just like the Van Ranger dolls. But this company is not tripping. They're not like, oh my goodness, she, they're they're copying off of us and all that mess. They're not they're not doing that. They're um, <laughs> they're letting people live, you know. So they have a doll like that. They're not Behringer. The Behringer um, people who made the Behringer dolls, they're not coming after this doll collector saying, hey, you stole that, or they're not coming after yeah the collectors and harassing them over the dolls no they're not doing that so what i'm going to do is find her something cute see she's a little bigger i don't know if she can fit um this outfit or not i should have got her she really needs some reborn clothes let me see what I got for her. Let me see what I can, what I got for her in here. So give me a minute. I'm all unorganized. That's okay. That's okay. Oh, okay. You know what? I'm putting on this. I'm, I'm putting on this outfit right here. I think this is going to be cute on her. Let me just take this one off. Let me back up this tripod so we can get a better view of my collection. So this she's gonna be number six. Like I said, I forgot their names. I'll have to go back and look at the video that I um showed them in. If I re if I remember to tag, well not tag, to link that video in the description, you guys can see me dressing them. I did a speed changing speed changing and dress them in this, in the outfits that I'm taking them out of now. And that was over a year ago, I think. I think that was. Look how pretty. I wanna say it was. So I think that she is bigger, a lot bigger than the Behringer dolls. But she still have that Behringer shape and look to her. She is anatomically correct put her on this outfit now this outfit is I think matter of fact one of my barrages um, she might have came in this outfit or she might have came in a blue one I'm not sure I'm not sure see she I don't know if she could fit this I might go to find her uh no, she can't fit this. She's too big. She can't fit this. Oh my goodness, she can't fit it. So what I'm going to do is maybe she could fit this shirt. This is shirt and pants over here. Yeah, I think she could fit this one. 
Hey, that's okay. I'm trying something for you. This is a cute little shirt. It has a panda bear on it. And it just has this Velcro that goes down the back. Such, such. Ooh, gotta do something with her hair. Here's some pants, some little pink pants. I'm not sure or not if it, if it goes with this outfit. I'm not quite 100% sure, but it guess what? It's gonna go today. Ain't that right? It's gonna go today. I'm glad I like kept all of their clothes together because if not, it would take me so long to find to find their clothes in a mix of everything. So, here she is. She's a little in the water, but these could be like little capri pants. This is cute. What do you think, what do you think? I need a brush, oh my goodness. Here she is, so cute. This is another one I'm gonna have to put a hair Hair bow for them. I have to have one for her, her, and her. But this is she, my Tonio one beautiful, beautiful doll. Like she's sweet. All right, I'm just gonna put her here. And then we have another one. Yes, look at her. Look at her. So cute. Let me take her out of this. Now she's like the same size as this one here. These two are bigger um, Behringer dolls. And this one is the regular size Behringer. But um, let me take her off this winter stuff. And it wasn't even last winter. It was the winter. The winter um, before last winter. <laughs> That's how long they've been in these clothes. Yes, they have been a while. And somebody else, the other dolls could be wearing these clothes. I have to wash these and put these on another doll. My other newborn babies size dolls. These are regular um, newborn size or preemie size clothes. Look at her, say hi. You guys can see me in all my glory. Okay. All right, y'all, let me find her something to put on. I wonder if she could fit that outfit, but she is, she's one of the bigger ones, too. I don't know. I don't know. Um, I need to put her. I don't really want her on that. And I don't want to put her on my um Kimby doll stuff because I have to change my Kimby dolls, and they need their own clothes. Okay. We're not gonna have these ones take off, take my candy dog baby clothes. Okay, let me find her something really quick. All right, so I found this cute little onesie. So I'm just gonna put her on this onesie by itself. This is very sweet, cause she is very sweet. I thought that this would be so adorable on her. So I see here. So what I like about this one here, she has these afros and it got indented in because of the um the the hat or the hair bear hair hair band, excuse me, that she was um wearing for a long period of time. So it dented it in some. But I could just take like a little pick and pick it out. But um I think that she is so adorable. Isn't that right? Yes, and I pierced her ears. She has pierced ears. So these are really um, fun dolls to have in your doll collection. Um, I enjoy my Behringer collection. Um, I just think that they're definitely necessary um, for me because like I stated, they are the original Reborns. Um, they started, people started reborning these type dolls 
people still do reap on these and i think that the people who do i think they do awesome uh, awesome awesome job um let me put her put her up here she's a little tiny she needs to be in the front but i think they did an awesome job with um the reborning of behringer's behringer dolls so let me count so how many girls do i have I have, let me bring her over so you guys can see her. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven girls, okay? So um, these are seven Behringer baby girls that I have in my collection. So um, I have one more to show, my only boy. I'm going to show you him. Yes, yes, yes. All right. So, so here see. is my only boy and guess what he is a reborn Behringer, Behringer excuse me doll a reborn Behringer doll yes look how adorable he is this is the snooky face Behringer and this is a doll size big bigger baby um he was custom made he has on a custom brown body and he is my only reborn Behringer doll in my collection yes and he was um, a play doll he was a somebody's play doll that um, an artist took and reborn him I actually bought him off of reborns.com years ago um I can't recall right away who his artist is but look at him look at the hair beautifully painted hair on this doll beautifully rooted eyelashes i fell in love with him when i saw him this he's a classic he will forever be in my collection um i want to put him on a cloth diaper which i'm going to do after the video because i don't have any um cloth diapers down here on the couch but look at him he's so sweet this is his little feet don't you want something in his little feet like something from the um the blanket that he was laying in these are his little hands yes so i originally i remember i originally named him malcolm but when I got Brother Malcolm, I had to name Brother Malcolm Malcolm, okay? So I took his name, and I think I renamed him, I want to say Mitchell. <laughs> I'm not sure. Oh, my goodness. So I have to look, look back at the videos again. So I'm putting him on this cute little sleeveless stripe outfit. Oh, I'm going to keep him in this long sleeve shirt because he has the one-fourth arms. These are cloth arms. Maybe I should have showed you that. It's just, it looks just like the, the leg, like this. <laughs> it does. He has he his uh, mouth is magnetized, so he take a um uh a magnet. He takes a pacifier, magnetized pacifier. He does. Yes, he does. I'm gonna change him out of this pamper. But for the purposes of the video, um, I'm going to leave it on. Because we're almost finished with the video because he was the last Behringer to show. To share with you all, my only boy. And I kept her up here because she's my newest baby. So she's going to work as the Dolly co-host for this video. And um, yeah. So since he has the one-fourth cloth limbs i thought that this outfit would fit him nicely and it does because it covers up covers up his cloth <laughs> he is a mix of um, a cuddle baby he reminds me of a cuddle baby because he is so cuddly his head is hard though he has hard like this is really hard but i think that he is just so sweet i think that he was a treasure that i found um, and this is one of my forever babies because he's a classic. He is the original Behringer doll 
I'm gonna bring it closer. Yes, the original Behringer dog. Oh, and um, he's reborn. So he's a good mix of my reborn collection and my Behringer. Like, what? This is a classic. This is a classic. Um, you don't see much of these. This Snoopy face. I only seen one other one that was reborn and uh, uh and it was in the um the Behringer Facebook dog group. The Behringer Facebook dog group. And um that one was cute too. This is the only AA one, African American one that I've seen. So he is definitely a keeper. I love him. And I'm going to go ahead and end the video with that. Yes. Get little Miss Flossie in here and my new baby over here from Maritza. All right, you guys. I had fun with Play Day Saturday. Thank you, Patricia, for creating this tag. It was really, really fun. You guys check out her channel. It's going to be linked in the description of the video. Thank you so very much, Stephanie, for your All Dolls Matter because they do, okay? Um, this Dress Up Thursday theme, All Dolls Matter, was really nice. Thank you. If you guys have not subscribed to Stephanie, which I doubt you're not, but if you're not, her channel is going to be in the description of the video. She is the largest reborn YouTube channel that I know of. I mean, she has over a million um, subscribers on her channel and she's been doing this um, YouTube reborn um, hobby for a very long time and she's an artist so you guys go over there and check out her channel you guys go check out Marissa's channel Dolly Lane 19 she is a new collector she is an aspiring reborn artist and um you guys go show her channel some love as well she's a newer um yeah newer channel so yes all right you all so this is the end of the video i have to go log in so i can study okay so i can get my knowledge in all right so you guys have a wonderful blessed saturday and as always you all stay blessed because you are be safe out there and we will be back for another video oh wait a minute wait a minute let me back it up you guys i forgot to count all of the dolls together so this is one two three four five six seven eight we have eight yep because we had seven girls so we have eight behringer dolls in my collection eight all right you guys i do apologize i'm trying to do my closing i forgot to count so i have eight behringer dolls in my collection all right, I think the next one I might do the Kimbies. We'll see. All right, you all. And as always, again, stay blessed because you are. Be safe out there. And we will be back for another video. Bye-bye.